feel like I just want to make something that I feel uh, is my best work. And as soon as I make one, I'm like, okay, well now I need to make another one. And I'm just trying to get better. You know, this is really the main thing that I'm good at in life is sort of playing and, uh, you know, kind of just going inside the song and, and playing songs and play at a lot of sort of non-venue type joints where I go and sing cover songs or, you know, maybe squeeze in a couple of my own tunes uh, at bars, restaurants, wherever, you know. Uh, so with all that and then, you know, occasionally I get to do like a really cool showcase type of venue, like we'll play at the Hi-Fi or, uh, you know, something where it's the people that are there want to hear my original stuff, you know, so that those are fewer um, and, and probably not as financially rewarding, but uh, all total, I probably play a hundred shows a year, something like that, maybe, maybe more, maybe less. I've been trying everything I can't think to prove to you this ain't gonna be how it was before but you've been doing everything you can't think to move me off the fence that I've been hanging on yeah I know you're sweet way down inside the things you do the things you do they don't say what you said last night No, the things you do, they don't lie They're as good as you oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Everything I had to give, I already gave you Isn't that the way it's supposed to be? Guess I saw myself in songs I did today are all part of uh, what will ideally be my debut release. Um, I've spent some time recording uh, kind of a, I guess you'd call it like a modern paradigm type of recording where I sort of threw everything at the wall and recorded all the various sounds that I might have heard in my head and tried to communicate the songs through there that way. And those are done, ready to go. But uh, right now I'm in the process of uh, going and re-recording some of the ones where I went and made this like imaginary band recording that I feel like, you know, that's 
maybe I could, maybe we could do it better as this stripped down thing. So we went back a couple weeks ago and did some recordings of that. And uh, once I'm done with these, it'll basically be a, you know, I like this version of this song, that version of that song, and try to make a cohesive release and put it out. But uh, ideally sometime before the end of this year, I'll have some music out for the public. There's videos of me playing songs and stuff out there, surely, but I wanna put my uh, formal release out there. I'm just trying to get it all tight right now, so. I was alone, broken and bleeding on the side of the road until she took me in. She cleaned up my wounds from a reckless engagement, was one for the ages I took on the chin. And when I came to, she was hovering over, humming a tune. sang the verse I chimed in for the chorus Oh, what a glorious hallelujah Well, I barely escaped the long arm of the Lord To the arms of a girl with the Lord in her heart I was back on my feet and we strolled through the courtyard She in her habit and I in her mood So I asked her about God in her life in his service Just trying my very best not to intrude And she told me quite plainly in stories of harlotry street in the light of the moon She was down on her knees when he came from on high Yeah, you swept down and saved her not a moment too soon Yeah, I narrowly escaped the long arm of the Lord To the arms of a girl with the Lord See, she'd been bathed in the light and the love But what I've done and what I'll do There ain't no washing on in the arms of the Lord. I hope that they feel like I'm working my ass off to try to entertain them on one level and uh, that they can sort of feel that I'm intensely trying to perform um, and trying to sink into the music and my own little thing, but also just put on a show. And then, you know, if uh, they can hear what I'm saying and hear the lyrics and take some sort of personal meaning away from the songs, that's always something I want. I mean, from a show, it's more like, I would like someone to walk away and say, you know, man, that dude was just killing it in his own thing up there. And then somehow I was in it too, all of a sudden. <laughs> if I could reach enough people to sustain me going around the country and 
playing my own songs and doing venue shows as opposed to going and playing Paul Simon and Beatles songs and stuff like that all night, which I love, but it'd be a lot more maybe fulfilling to me if I could go and do all that and just do my thing and, and be uh, financially stable for that, you know? She's an outlaw, but boy, 